Well, hello there. It's Tuesday, and I have a layout for you that is simply named Yes to Awesome. And it's because it is a picture about Fab's birthday. So <laughs> this was a gift that I bought him, and I wrapped, and I decorated and so it's a huge gift because he's a huge guy and as you can see it's a big gift so um, yeah he was just like super excited and I just took some of my scraps in green colors from the citrus twist March Oliver kit and layered the back of the photo and then also a strip at the bottom that's just torn and pulled some of my washi out of my stash and kind of went to town and so I just put it on the white American crafts background and I'm doing a very monochromatic layout I even deep dove into some old acrylic letters and yeah it was fun it was quick it was easy it was simple and I love how happy he looks here this is actually the twine that came with the kit it, she always uses twine to wrap the kits up in the tissue paper and so I made a cute little bow for my cute little bab and that is what's going on the side there just as some you know a little extra texture and a little extra something the loop didn't want to cooperate so I made it cooperate <laughs> and you'll see me stick that down and I will start to add some cut aparts from the citrus twist kit and also some of my fave little hearts that I punch out I uh, usually use a like, glitter paper for that, die cuts with a, no, is it die cuts with a view? Yeah, die cuts with a view glitter stack. So that stuff, oh my gosh, I just punched tons and tons of hearts out of it with a little heart punch. And it's like my little favorite bowl of go-to when I'm finishing up a layout. So you'll see me do that. I did fussy cut the word yes out of that cut apart and then it was like a little three by four or two by three or something i don't know one of the cut aparts um from the papers and it said yes to awesome but i just fussy cut out the yes and then i cut the two and the awesome out and layered it on to the page but i know it can be a confusing title because alan even looked at it and said something like when you see it done, it, it I also put a little strip um, from their exclusives, which is a label that says totally you. So he said, yes, totally you, too awesome. And I was like, no, it's yes to awesome. I just happened to put the cut apart label in the wrong spot. And so it doesn't read exactly the way I want it to at first glance. But, you know, live and learn. Now I have to explain the page, I guess, but... That's okay. I don't mind. Uh, Yolo was also in the cut aparts. It was one of the exclusives. Mm, I do end up adding, what, a little yellow bicycle stick pin. That's a little piece of wood veneer that I'll add to the page, and I just pull the pin off. I've been trying to use those up, so you'll see them on several layouts to come. And it will go above YOLO. 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 <laughs> okay, so I know I'm being silly. Anyway, um, um, what does that say? Own your happy. Alan definitely owns his happy. And he's not afraid to smile and laugh. And under YOLO it says my one and only. And then there's that totally you that makes the title so confusing. And I do move that arrow. I don't think that arrow stays, but no, I move the arrow. So I deep dove. Oh, I'm adding that wood veneer right now. You'll see I also added a cut apart label 
and I do end up adding that tag right there and I'll put some of that twine through it as well um, so yeah back to what I was my mind wandered bab is spelled out in some really old acrylic letters and a wonderful subby reminded me that those were from KI Memories, and I took them all out of their packages a long time ago, probably 10 years ago, maybe longer, and I didn't remember that they were KI Memories, so I just love having subbies because <laughs> I have a terrible memory, and apparently some of y'all have a fantastic memory and really appreciate product the way I do. So thank you to whoever told me who those are from. Hopefully I won't forget <laughs> as I use them. I'm trying to use up really old stash. Um, I do use some of those cork arrowheads from Studio Calico and then these wood letters, I wanna say are Studio Calico from a long time ago, but don't quote me, I could be wrong. But yeah, I think so. Again, no packaging thrown into a container with other wood veneer, my bad. Oh, look, I added two of those wood buttons. Uh, Joy is up at the top from Little Yellow Bicycle. I forgot I added that. And then um, Smile is the one above YOLO. So what else do I do? Um, I'm gonna add some of those hearts like I told you about, and that's a really unusual green color, but it's kind of holographic, so an iridescent or whatever. So it worked well. It worked really well with all the different greens. Adding a little bit of Heidi Shine in mint. And I think that wraps it up. Yeah, that does it. So, um, oh, look, I'm taking pictures so that I can upload pictures for you. I'm so glad I kept that in to bore you with. <laughs> anyway. I hope you're having a great day. I am. It's beautiful outside. I have had um, an interesting week. I've just kind of let things go at work as far as like stress. And I'm trying to just focus on the end goal and keep it at that. Alan and I have done some really great things around the house and there's more to come. Oh, and his parents are coming for a visit. Ooh, this ought to be interesting. I will take lots of pictures for you, but that's Easter weekend, so stay tuned. That's it for now. Ta-ta. Bye.